Hey guys, today I'll be going over how to get the most value out of Moira's Biotic Orb and the things you need to keep in the back of your mind when you play as her. The main thing I'll be showing is how the orb bounces off surfaces and how you can maximize the value you get from the orb by using the surfaces on the map. To make this video I'm using the workshop code ESXBZ. This is a Moira Orb Trainer. I'd recommend that you save it as a preset so that you can use this later. This workshop mode shows you where your orb is going to bounce to first. And it also has a bird's eye view so that you can see where it would be going when get it's not out of the player's sight. To get the most value, you must know where the first bounce is going to send your orb. Onwards from there, you can start to practice where the second bounce will take it but it's paramount that you at least know where the first bounce will send. An easy way to get value out of the orb is to throw it between two 90 degree facing walls so it just bounces between the two. But this is just something basic to ensure the orb stays around your team. You should also practice delivering the orb to your teammates at tougher angles because this will happen more often. I was practicing using the workshop code in Busan and found an angle I hadn't used in game before. I managed to use that in game later that day and I'll show you the footage of that in just a moment. Just to be clear, throwing orbs on these strange angles isn't what you need to be doing all of the time. Sometimes just throwing the orb into a small room or through the main choke will get you the most value. It's just important to remember that you have these off angles available to you if the opportunity presents itself. This has been my super quick Moira Orb guide. If you enjoyed it, please consider liking and subscribing. I do stream on Twitch as well, so you can follow me there. If you want to see more content like this, please let me know in the comments and I'll get to work. Thank you.